at home, IBOB wants UNISIC YF demand postponement of convocation and exam. The indigenous people of Biafra IPOB has warned the vice chancellor, Unamdi Azikwe University, UNISIC, Oka, and Ambra State, Professor Charles Ezimoni, and West African Examination Council, YF, to postpone the convocation ceremony of the university and YF exam scheduled for May 30. IPOB in a statement by its media and public citizen secretary Ima Parafun entitled Nam Diazikwe University VC and Waek board to postpone May 30th convocation and Waek on that day. Said Professor Ezimoni ought to know that 30th of May every year is Biafra Heroes Day and should not fix any programs of his university on that day. Just as Waek should have known that that day is sacrosanct to all Igbo men and women. IPOB statement reads Dear Professor Charles Okechuku Esimone, Vice Chancellor, Unambi Azikwe University, Oka, Unizi, Anambra State. The attention of the global family and movement of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB, led by our indomitable leader, Mazi Unambi Kano has been drawn to your proposed university's convocation date of 30th May 2024 and the YF examinations for the, for the same day. We urge you to kindly reschedule your convocation and exams to a new date because 30th of May is the Biafra Heroes Day and a sit at home for all Biafrans in the Biafra land. Dear VC Simone, if you consider yourself a Biafra, you ought to know that 30th of May is a Biafra Heroes Day. And YEC board members, Biafra Heroes Day is sacrosanct to Indigo. You dare not fix your exam on that day if you have respect for evil ways. Nevertheless, we are reminding you and the UNISIC management <coughs> and YEC board that May 30 of every year is a sacred day set aside to honor Biafra heroes and heroines who pay the ultimate price and sacrifice for the survival of Biafrans. That day remains sacred and a day that Biafrans sit at home to remember and honor our heroes who fell during the Nigerian genocidal war against Biafra between 1967 to 1970. Even until the present day, the killing has not stopped. No public event is expected to take place in Biafra land on this day. Biafra Heroes Day is a public day and a sit at home in Biafra land for Biafrans in honor of our fallen heroes and heroines. All markets, schools, banks, government, and private offices are expected to be under lock and key. If anything happens to those children they want to bring out that day, they will regret doing so. By this open letter to so UIPOB, is calling on the Vice Chancellor and the management of Namde Azikwe University, UNICEF, OKA. YEC and any other person or group that scheduled any program for 30th May 2024 to postpone such program by Afra Heroes Day take precedence over any program by Afra Land on that day. However, if the Vice Chancellor and the management of UNICEF insist on having their convocation on 30th of May in disregard of Biafra falling heroes and heroines, they have decided to spit on the graves of Biafra heroes and heroines and should really take responsibility for whatever happens afterwards. We do not take it kindly with people who desecrate the memory of our heroes and heroines. I feel because on the students, the parents, the guests, and this just to UNICEF's congregation ceremony and those for YX exams scheduled for May 30th to so apply caution and avoid being on the road the day by our fans that morning they are dead. The university goes ahead with the plan, safety is an individual responsibility. Don't endanger yourself for an hour long ceremony. IPOB is therefore warning all the persons and institutions paid to insult and desperate memories of our fallen heroes that their sponsors will not be there to save them when the rain starts falling on them. Those that have sabotaged their stock in trade will be collectively and individually held to account for their evil. IPOB is not an umuna meeting or community meeting to be toyed with. As much as we care, we also bite. Unity management and wired board should be warned. And that is the news for today as the IPOB has come out to warn UNICEF and YF stating that May 30 is a day for their fallen heroes and that no other program should come up on that day.
don't forget to like this video, comment under this video and subscribe to this channel to get more news from this channel.